Damn. Where are you off to? Shit. Where you running off to, Carl? I thought we were friends. Yeah, whatever. As an officer in charge of putting an end to gang violence, I find myself in a difficult moral position, Carl. Yeah, right. Carl, I'm hurt. I truly am. And just as I was about to help those poor Grove Street boys. Oh, yeah? How? I like the status quo, Carl. I like having all you bastards doing my job for me, blowing each other's guts all over the side. Dumb bastards. Now, if it's brought to my attention that one tribe gets an unfair advantage over another, that truly troubles me, Carl. So what you saying, man? I'm saying the ballers have brains, Carl. They watch the news. I'm saying they're making friends, cutting deals, and tooling up for more than half-assed drive-bys. Lots of cheap guns coming into America since the fall of the wall, Carl. Man, cut that bullshit, Tim Penny. Just say what you mean, man. Go check out a busy freight warehouse down the Docklands and you'll see what I mean, Carl. Yeah, okay. Y'all take care now. For sure. World. That's all you got? You want me to shoot you as well? This the best you got? Yeah, what you gonna do now? Hey, what was you saying? I don't give a shit!
Huh? What? We'll be right there! It's my constitutional right, bitch! Gun in your face, huh? What's up, sweet? We got a problem. Some punk ass bass ass fool has been slanging to his grown brother. What? Who? Check this out. He's been buying shit over in Glen Park. He know the hood's talking, and he's hiding out with his new ball of friends. Shit, man. How we gonna get to him? It's time for you to not show return, CJ. You fuck up Glen Park, and that turncoat bitch ass nigga's gonna lose nerve and make a break for it. Okay, I'm gonna come pick you up. Hell no. This is your gig, CJ. You need some strikes. Get over to Army Nation and get a heater.